today I'm making some Indian street food. What is called dahi puri? It's a puri is like a round shape. I will show you. These are the we call puris. You can see how it looks. You can buy this from Indian store or you can buy online too. So you can make this your own, but you know like more work. So I just bought this from Indian store, Indian grocery store. I'm preparing chickpea. So I already cooked this chickpea first. Chickpea cook, you can use a canned chickpea too if you want. Chickpea or garbanjo are same. And so now I'm going to fry this. I'm using two tablespoons of olive oil here. I'm using half teaspoon of cumin seed. Here is the cumin seed. And same time, I'm using half cup of chopped onion. Just fry this onion for uh, three to four minutes. Now I'm going to add this uh, garlic. I have a three clove of garlic chopped here. Let's cook this garlic for minute and two. Okay. Now I'm going to add this garbanzo. Uh, I'm going to add some salt here to taste or half teaspoon because I already have salt here while I was cooking this. I'm going to add some chili powder here like one four teaspoon. You don't have to actually you can use uh, later this. Okay I'm going to put this lid on and let this cook for five minutes because this chickpeas already cooked. So we don't have to cook them so long. Okay, so this is the tamarind chutney, very quick and easy. You just get some uh, tamarind or imli uh, concentrate, but I have the whole imli I got, so I just soak them in the water. And so this is the easy way and like a fresh, you have to eat this fresh. You cannot keep this for a long time. There's another way you can make, which you can keep them for a few months. I'm using half teaspoon of salt in here and uh, I'm using one four teaspoon of cumin seed powder and one four teaspoon of chili powder, red chili powder. So mix them all. This is our tamarind chutney is ready. You can taste this and you can see according to your taste, you can add salt, chili powder, and more cumin seed powder if you want. So here is Azariah. He's helping me to cut this potato. Filling for uh, for those puri. So I have some uh, cooked potato, boiled potato here. I just use. You can use how much you need it, but this is I think more than enough. So it's, these are only three red potatoes. I'm using dry mango powder, half teaspoon red chili powder one four teaspoon salt to taste or i'm using here one teaspoon a little bit cilantro you can add here chop cilantro if you want don't have to have all mix them together let's take this puri and make hole here with your hand or with your spoon like this see and add some potato many different way you can make this chart and this is the easier way I'm, I'm making and now you can add uh, all the spices here if you want like more salt you know you don't have to add salt anything right now you just check first so now I'm going to add the stem ring chutney and you can see how much you want and this is called dahi puri so dahi means yogurt and these are the puri. So you know this is just plain whole yogurt. So you can uh, spice this up also. You can add some salts, little bit honey here also. But I'm not going to add any sweet here. And just add some yogurt here. Right here. Like this. And so this is done. That's the way you can and you can add some pomegranate seed here if you want. And you can check if you need more salt, more uh, cilantro. 
You can even add some onion here also. You know, one or two onion if you okay with eating raw onion. You can add onion. Tastes good. Okay, it's good. Tomato, Papa. Here's the puri, potatoes. This is cumin seed powder, salt, dry mango powder, it's okay. cilantro, onion, lemon if you need it, tamarind chutney, green chili, mm -hmm. red chili powder, tomato chopped, yogurt, and this chickpea also. I cook the chickpeas, so you can like make a side. Uh, like a chart on the side with the mix with the potatoes and all this different spices whatever you like so these are the all the options we have here and this is the final presentation here you can see it looks pretty good and i'm gonna try it as i said it uh, you love it so let's see this is the final presentation let me try this mm. it's very good we can spice it up more how you want you know like you can add some more uh, chili powder more salt you know yogurt you can have like yogurt so you don't want greek yogurt you want like a runny yogurt in this and for the yogurt you can use some little bit salt you can add some salt also you can add some uh, actually honey in the yogurt to make a little bit sweeter Pori. Pori? What's pori? Pori. <laughs> pori. <laughs> <laughs> 